The Woodlands Elite Black Ops recap is now in the bottom right portion of your screen. Take a look here. Look at those hitch kick doubles. The height and the way they catch, there's no excessive movement from any of the bases on those catches. The flyers were uniform, the toss libs hit to the top. Bases did not move. So good so far. Whip double timing couldn't have been better. Great job. Transition here. Toe full. Majority of those athletes did do a standing full. Multiple two to doubles. Three to doubles from the boys. And uh, finishing with the two to whip double. We're going to transition into our rewind up to the top. That center rewind over toss caught above the top. That was incredible. Little balance check there on that full round tick. Not going to cost them. Quarter twisting tick tock. Then they come down to those lib kick double fools. Like we had talked about earlier, that is an elite level six element on top of the six, on top of the other skills that they were doing as well. Moving into the running tumbling. Fools, doubles, multiple specialty through to doubles here in the running tumbling. We're gonna transition into the jumps, hurdler, Toto with a back tuck at the end. The timing on that could not have been better. Every single section looks absolutely, absolutely tight. It is, it is, they are not leaving any room on the table for deductions, for execution. This is great cheerleading. What I would expect to see from the Woodlands Elite Black Ops. Anything can happen. They just needed to come in, hit, and then the rest of the teams will do whatever they're gonna do and the cards will fall as they do. They move into their dance. While they're dancing, predictions for small senior co-ed based off of what we've seen so far, we would have Woodlands Elite Black Ops in our top spot, Singray All-Stars Purple after that, and Twist and Shout Obsession. That's gonna be the top three based off of yesterday's scores, based off of difficulty, based off of what we saw today and deductions. Of course, there could be, you know, that third place spot, Steel, uh, excuse me, Top Gun, Royal Jags, or Cheer Athletics Royal Cats could come into that bronze spot. Certainly Woodlands Elite is going to be in that top spot. They are in fourth coming into finals today. We will see how the Arista division pans out in just a couple of minutes here.